it's that the political consensus uh, around this mine and whether it should get government support uh, is over. Um, Federal Labor's been arguing against the, the, the Northern Australia Infrastructure Facility loan and now the Palaszczuk government is going to veto it. And I, I think there's a chance now, of course, though, for Palaszczuk to position that not as just as vetoing that loan, she still backs the mine, but to sell it as a, um, a win for other areas of the economy, that money is now freed up to be spent um, potentially on tourism infrastructure, health inf infrastructure. Uh, we had some, the Australian Institute had some polling out not so long ago asking the, the people of Queensland what they'd most like to see that money spent on and coal infrastructure was way at the bottom of the list on 11 percent many more people wanted it spent on health infrastructure tourism infrastructure renewables infrastructure education infrastructure so i think there's a chance actually as controversial as this decision has been over the last two days for labor to reposition itself and say well actually this we could come up with money that will be spent more wisely better for the environment of course but better for jobs too remember mining is very capital intensive and not labor intensive uh, intensive and more popular i mean one whatever whatever your position on the adani mine has been there's been a clear majority of people at state local and federal level opposed to the subsidies going to the mine.